Disney collection. So let's talk about what this collection is. It includes, of course, a digital kit and 12 by 12 papers, or you can get the Traveler's Notebook papers, the pattern cards. There are two sets of journaling cards, three sheets of stickers, and as a bonus, this weekend only, you can get these Traveler's Notebook signatures for free with the purchase of the digital kit. They will also be available in the store as a standalone purchase after this weekend, after the prom promotion is over. Um, so there's a lot to unpack in this kit. So let's get to unpacking it. This collection is about uh, making lists of the things you love. There is no reference to romantic love in this collection. There's a little bit of, ro of reference to loving people, but not necessarily romantically. So if you are unattached or if you are just so sick and tired of all of the love kits being about how much you love your significant other and you just want something that's fun and full of hearts and colorful and not necessarily about um, a romantic partner, this is the collection for you. So what I designed this collection to be is a way to document all of the things that you love, whether it is um, TV shows, items, people, things you love about yourself, anything in that vein. So let's take a look at the patterns. So the patterns come in 12 by 12 papers, traveler's notebook size papers, or um, patterned cards. These are the three by four size. When you buy the pattern cards, you also get four by six size. And any pattern that has a specific orientation comes in both horizontal and vertical on the printable PDF sheet. So you can have both copies without any fuss. Let's look at the patterns a little bit bigger on the Traveler's Notebook papers though. So there are 21 patterns in this collection because this pattern I loved so much. I wanted it in white with black hearts and black with white hearts. So I included both in the collection. And you will notice that all of the papers have sort of a little bit of distressing. Not all have things like ink blotches on them, but they are just all slightly distressed, a little bit grungy in some places. So we also have a beautiful wood grain ombre paper. Love rainbow ombre some painted stripes with you can see the distressing on here as well this light pink with white i love my myself a big plaid so that is what i included in this collection and then there is a smaller tonal white and blue plaid as well one of the most fun signature papers in this collection is this cute doodly heart collection with the scripty words in the background. Then this wood grain XOXO. Another, or this is one of the florals in the collection. This one is on yellow. I love this really rich yellow for this collection rather than sort of a fluorescent yellow or even a really light yellow. I love the deep richness that this color yellow brings to this collection. Brings it out of the pastel range and down into something a little less candy coated, which is super fun. Here's another floral. This one is black and white. Another fun paper from this collection has all of these cute words. So we've got some kind of wonderful heart melt, love, so happy. There's a good mix of colorful words as well as black and white words. And then we've got these little Instagram hearts as well. And then also some of the words have um, brush strokes behind them because uh, brush strokes is a sort of a theme in this collection. Here is another plaid because you know I can't help it. This one is tonal pink, sort of a buffalo plaid. Speaking of paint strokes, there is a paint stroke paper. Oh, look at all those cute little Instagram hearts. You can see the distressing on this paper as well. My favorite floral in the collection is of course always the bold floral. Then we've got a few tonal papers as well. Put that one away for a second. So we've got tonal in pink, blue, gray, and 
yellow. So they have different patterns on them. We've got a, ha uh, not a hound's tooth, a, oh gosh, of course I'm forgetting the word. <laughs> oh well, diamonds, dots, and scallops. Then there's also a sort of tonal in a black and white with these little plus signs. Here are all of the main colors of the collection. There are six solids. I printed myself out a second plaid because I loved it so much. And then the last two pattern papers in the collection, of course, the reverse of that white with black. We've got black with white hearts and XOXO in color. So those are all the patterns from the Loveless collection. Again, they are available in Traveler's Notebook size, 12 by 12, and patterned card size. So there are two sets of journaling cards, and I think they're all mixed up. So there is journaling cards set one and two. Each journaling card set includes uh, eight three by fours and two four by sixes. So all together, there are 16 three by fours and four four by sixes. So there are two, actually there's three journaling cards in this collection. This one is just fun with that um, tonal floral, but this time in pink and a little cute scallop. I love these. I did a lot of layering for these journaling cards, lots of fun um, embellishments rather than the more simple journaling cards that I've been sort of leaning towards lately. Got that rainbow ombre wood grain in the background. This one says so much to love about this. And then you are at the top of my love list, which of course you can refer to a person, but you can also refer to your pets. You can refer to anything when you say you. So there are 16 three by fours. Again, these are all mixed up. So I'm looking at both sets of cards while we flip through. So this says, this is the good stuff. Again, with that layering, and you can see that it has a very faint stripe so that you can journal in straight lines. Thought bubbles. more of this, less of this. There were some cards and some references I wanted in this collection to sort of um, have a contrast, like uh, things you love, things you might not love so much if you wanted to journal about that. Of course, those adorable Instagram hearts with paint strokes. Love this most. We went through all the, almost all the journaling cards in the beginning. <laughs> Crazy for this. Now, of course, you can add your journaling here, or you could even add a photo as well. Love, 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 love. With a fun hand-drawn heart in the middle of that one. Totally fell in love with this. So again, you can see no references to romantic love in this collection. You can totally use this for so many things. I mean, you can use it for romantic love too. The first layout I'm going to do is going to be about my husband and I, but I'm going to also use it for uh, things I love about myself and things that I'm loving right now, that kind of thing. Do things that fill your soul with sunshine. I love these hand-drawn hearts. So fun. Another journaling card. This one a little bit more simple in case you didn't want to have that layered look going on. Double tapped because you love it. Does it spark joy? Shout out to Marie Kondo. And lastly, life is too short to chase anything but the things that make you stupidly happy. So those are all of the journaling cards for this collection. I want to go through the Traveler's Notebook signatures. And then lastly, we will take a look at the stickers. So there are 12 signatures in this Traveler's Notebook signature set. Uh, basically, what I think of for Traveler's Notebook signatures are giant journal cards. So these are not going to be patterned papers for the most part. Like this isn't one of the patterned papers in the collection. I made it specifically for the Traveler's Notebook signatures and you won't find it anywhere else. So there is no overlap between this and the Traveler's Notebook papers. 
but holy cow, how adorable is this? I love it so much. So there's going to be a mix of journal cards and um, also word art as well in this collection or in this set. I always love to include a strip, paper strip sort of background with all of the different backgrounds that you can cut apart if you want to. Today I choose to focus only on the things that make my soul sing with joy and you can see that this matches the journaling cards so they go together but they're different. You deserve a life that excites you. So again this is all in the vein of love and happiness and joy um, that we're going for with this collection. Find out where joy resides and give it a voice, for to miss the joy is to miss all, which is a quote from Robert Louis Stevenson. Okay, you can't have a love list collection without a place for a love list. So we've got a whole Traveler's Notebook signature page for this where you can write all top 10 things you're loving right now. It says currently on my love list. So we've got sort of a... Um, that one journaling card, but larger. And you can use this for journaling, of course, but you can also use it just as a base for photos. So cute, I love this one. Favorites, now I didn't print it out, but if you spell favorites with a U, there is an alternate in this collection as well, as well as all of the stickers. Anything that says favorites as the full word has a U version as well. Okay. This one took me the longest and it's my favorite because I love me some letter boards, but this Traveler's Notebook signature page is so fun. So every single letter board says something different and they all say things like, when in doubt, follow your heart, currently making me happy, you make my heart skip a beat, you are at the top of my love list, you have my whole heart, I adore everything about this, giving me all the hard eyes and good vibes, this is my happy place, I have a big, big love for this, that kind of a thing. And lastly, we have another journaling card. So finally, let's look at the stickers and I have them already cut out. So we're gonna look at them one by one. I'll pull them all out here. So there's a good mix in this collection of journaling labels and icons. So there are a ton of hearts and flowers because there's a whole sheet of hearts and flowers in the sticker sheet. So let's pull all those out at once. Well, as many as we can find off the bat here. Love me some hearts and flowers when I am scrapbooking. So I made sure to include an entire sheet full. So many of them. <laughs> there are a good mix of those doodly ones as well as the little outline ones. So you have a good variety to choose from when you are scrapbooking. <laughs> There's so many. You know, I love to fit as many stickers on my page as possible. I love to give you the most bang for your buck, so to speak. So, all right, let's look here. There's lots of journaling labels as well in different shapes and sizes. So I'm gonna pull all those out. Oh, look, more, more flowers. We've also got a Instagram heart in every color too. Because I love them so much. XOXO. This says, I didn't know I needed this. This is my love language. I love these. I don't normally include colorful backgrounds on my words, but I loved the way that these looked with the color in the background rather than on the word. So we've got XOXO, crushing, some kind of wonderful heart melt got a whole heart that says love oh my goodness all of the converse I keep wanting to call them conversation hearts but their Instagram hearts are stuck together so we got a few letter boards and light boxes in this collection I think there's one more around here somewhere that I'm missing where'd it go oh here it is okay happy heart faves list these are a few of my favorite things. This makes me so happy. I don't care. I love it. That gets the song stuck in my head every single time. 
more labels making me happy and big love for this all i need is this right here more labels xoxo we've got heck yes and heck no wherever that went another heart more labels i included a label in this shape for every color i like having labels that are the same size in different colors i always feel like that creates a good um, way to make lists on your page without it being repetitive my heart skips a beat love list this is my happy place and you'll see some of these elements repeated in the digital kit as well but in a different style because in the digital kit i make things look like they're realistic embellishments so they in this case will look like puffy stickers or enamel pins that sort of a thing there are three different tags in the sticker sheet they're all the same size so we've got one happy list right here in case you wanted something smaller to write your happy list down this one's a journaling label or a journaling tag and then the hearts There are a couple of labels. Oh, here's the other one. We've got flowers, XOXO, and a heart in this style. Oh, there's that other color. Oh my gosh, can you believe it? We still have so many left. Okay. There are also a bunch of paint strokes with words on them because I thought that that was a fun idea. So we've got... Oh, happy day, my whole heart, you plus me equals love, and my favorite. Let's put these over here. We're running out of room, no! Just means I included a lot. More journaling labels, more round labels. There's three different styles here. Oh, here's the heck no which you can see has actually a broken heart on it. Two of these pointy labels. Got some more flowers down here. See, I told you there's just a ton of flowers and they're all different too. Love your selfie, heart. Enjoy the moment. Another heart current faves. Adore all of this heart. I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. And if you just sang that song like me, you are old. <laughs> we are old. This made me smile today. Do what you love. Oh, my heart. Nope, oh, that didn't even, there we go. Oh my heart. There we go. And more or less of this, more of this. So we've got contrast again here. Nothing can top this. Embrace this day. Documented. P.S. I love this, not I love you. Make it a little different. Quit petting my peeves. So again, if you want to scrapbook things that bug you. And lastly, when in doubt, always follow your heart. So that is the entire Love List collection. Uh, it is available starting right now at tracyreed.com. There is a link in the description box below. I'm going to show you the digital part of this collection now. And last but not least, we have the Loveless Digital Kit, which you will see some of the same motifs and icons from the stickers and of course it includes the 12 by 12 papers as well as the um, alphabets. So 
uh, I just want to go over what's in the digital kits that I offer. I often get the question, are the cards and stickers included in the digital kits? And they are not. The digital kit is its own separate product with no repetition of the other products available other than the 12 by 12 papers, which are also available as their own separate product. So what you see here are digital embellishments meant for digital scrapbookers since they like a lot of depth on their pages in Photoshop. So you have things like faux wood veneer, faux enamel shapes, faux puffy stickers, we've got ribbons and felt flowers and frames and all kinds of other things that digital scrapbookers love to use. There are some repetition between the stickers and the um, embellishments in the digital kit but in the digital kit the things that are offered as stickers on the sticker sheets are offered in a different way so in this case they are offered as enamel pins wood veneer puffy stickers and chipboard so they have depth and they have texture to them that the um, sticker sheets do not have. So that is it for the love list. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can hop on over and get the love list on sale for 25% off right now and get the traveler's notebook signatures for free while the sale is on. All right. Thank you.